4.3b, Rates and Unit Rates. Find unit rate. A unit rate is the rate of price per unit. Unit rates are included on many things in grocery stores. And that's why we'll be using the unit rate to identify the better deal. Example 1. A 20 ounce bottle of soda sells for $1.99. What is the unit price? In this problem, it did not give us a per statement. So we need to remember that when it says unit price, that that is a specific statement in which it wants to know the price per whatever unit we are dealing with, which in this case is ounces. A unit price always has dollars on top. because we want to know how much money it costs for a specific unit. In this case, the unit is one ounce. We now set up the problem to find the dollars is $1.99. So in the numerator, we place $1.99. We then see that we need ounces for the denominator and that it's a 20 ounce bottle. We now place this in the calculator and it comes out as 0 0.0995 dollars per ounce. Many times when something comes out to a fractional portion of a dollar, we change it to cents. The way to change from dollars to cents is to move the decimal two places to the right. We therefore would then have 9.95 cents per ounce. Either of these is acceptable. Example 2. Lemon juice comes in a 24 ounce bottle and a 32 ounce bottle. The 24 ounce bottle sells for $1.98 and the 32 ounce bottle sells for $2.98. Which is the better deal and what is the unit price? In this question they asked us two things. We need to identify which is the better deal, but we also need to find their unit prices. Remember that a unit price always has dollars over whatever the unit is. Once again, our unit is ounces. Remember to keep the dollars on top. The first unit price we will calculate is that of the 24 ounce bottle we see that the 24 ounce bottle is $1.98. We put the dollars in the numerator, or $1.98, and we divide it by the ounces, which is 24. We then come up with a unit price for this first bottle. It comes out to 0.0825 dollars per ounce, or this could also be written as 8.25 cents per ounce. Next we find out the price of the second bottle. The second bottle is two dollars and ninety-eight cents for 32 ounces. When we divide, we first get 0 0.093125 dollars per ounce. We can then change this to cents once again and see that it would be nine dollars and or 9.31 cents per ounce. When we look at the two deals, we see that it costs us eight approximately cents per ounce 
or nine approximately cents per ounce. It would be a much better deal to pay less money and get the same amount. Both of these amounts is an ounce. In the first example, we see that we get, we have to spend less money to get the same amount. Therefore, the better deal would be that we get in the first one, which is $1.98 for a 24 ounce. Remember that when looking for unit rates, it is always price over unit. Also, when selecting a better deal, remember to consider which one is better. In the case of example two, you see that the first or smaller bottle was actually a better deal because you spent less money per ounce. 